What's up guys, this is 3X back with you again, and this, ladies and gentlemen, is Anarchy Reigns, released last week, just got it yesterday, and uh, this is going to be my next playthrough, there you see the uh, intro going through this game, uh, it was out for a while actually, back in last year. Um, over in Japan, released of course by Platinum Games, the uh, same folks behind Bayonetta and Mad World. So it finally got localized, and now here you have it in the States, available on PlayStation Network and uh, Xbox Live. So, I've heard a lot of good things about this game. It's kind of a throwback to the old school beat 'em up days of uh like fighting force and even before that like final fight you know double dragon games of that nature where your mission basically is just to beat the crap out of anything that stands in front of you and obviously it's got a good bit of characters really good character designs Bayonetta is actually a uh, DLC character that you can use in multiplayer, which is going to be pretty cool. And uh, we'll get to that eventually. But here you see the uh, two main characters of the game. I'm going to focus first on the uh, single player campaign, and then we'll do some multiplayer I actually messed around with multiplayer uh, last night when I bought the game. Well, it wasn't multiplayer, more like a practice mode, kind of simulating multiplayer. But this game definitely lives up to its uh, potential, lives up to its name, being Anarchy, because there's some serious chaos going on in this game, I'm telling you. And like I said before, the uh, character designs very nice a lot of a lot of badassery going on with these uh characters that you see here and uh i believe there are actually more characters to be unlocked through the game here you got all of them chilling in the bar i like him he's got pimp stag i like her even more Wonder what's underneath that skirt, baby. Yeah, the uh, the girls definitely uh, very well built. Some some good looking uh, female characters going on here. So yeah, um, not signed into the uh, PlayStation Network because as of this video. PlayStation Network's down for uh, system maintenance. It is uh, March, uh, April 15th, excuse me, so they announced it on their website and their forum that they're going to be down till at least 11 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so we're just going to go on and worry about the single player campaign anyway, so I'm not really too concerned about that. And We'll just be offline, because everybody else is offline today. <laughs> Take another look at these guys, yeah. Yeah. Definitely liking what I see so far. Looking forward to getting started on this game. Just want to have another look at them all. So let's get started. New game. Playing it on normal mode. And we go instantly for cutscene. Bird food. This guy had a real bad day. Oh, speaking of bad days. Think he's got a little bit of a headache. Okay, I don't know what's up with that. This is a reminder that this game is being brought to you by Platinum Games, the Bayonetta people. A 12-hour standoff at the Metro Altamba Bank on Wall Road ended when the 
when the Bureau of Public Safety High Crimes Division stormed the bank, killing five gunmen inside. Local organizations have broadly praised the BPS for the swiftly executed rescue operation, during which none of the 48 hostages were killed, though two were reported to have sustained serious injuries. Hmm. No casualties. Impressive. Okay, we're inside of this uh, pool hall, club, whatever it is. Special Director Nikolai Vlikin, High Crimes Division, spoke to us about the rescue operation. Chuck? Two of the hostages were severely injured, but you managed the rescue with no casualties. You must be pleased. Can you comment on the operation's success? No. Which is to say we make many options, we pick best strategy we make happen. Like every time. No thanks. I quit. Good call. Smoking is bad for you after all. Hey, everything's peachy. Yeah, well, I got here in one piece. You check the data I sent? Alright, I don't know who he's on the phone with, but I have seen a couple of the characters from the uh, start screen already in this club. And then there's these folks. Sasha. I think um, I, I'm I'm gonna like Sasha. And there's Leo and big old Nikolai who was on the screen a couple of seconds ago. Sources tell us that his escape was an inside job, and the murder charges were false. So can you tell us what really happened? What is this woman's gossip show? No comment. This man, you know? He sells gold nugget here. He's worth 10,000. Now you know? Kind of aggressive there, he isn't he? No, he doesn't know. And this isn't Mel Valen. Aren't you out of your jurisdiction? Big Jack. Nikolai kind of reminds me of, uh... Volgan Jack from Metal Gear Solid. Jack the Chaser. Huh. Nice eye. BS guys get all the perks. You get off on looking through everyone's dirty laundry. This BPS. Ah. Oh. You chase Max too, huh? Wait, Nikolai. I've just accessed security locks. Seems like Max has changed his look. Not for the better. The biometrics check out. It's him. Dummy Zabrasny. I already sent. Ah, it is him. And he still has tech. So he is dangerous. Yes, we know this. Look, comrade. Oh, that was a bad idea. But yeah. Rule number one about big, muscular Russian guys with electric powers. Don't approach them with malicious intent unless you're ready to get your shit twisted. Okay, so now I have a choice to make of which side I want to fight for, and I guess that means which character I want to fight with. Black side or white side? I'm interested to see if Jack gets a little payback on Nikolai for that sucker punch. So we're gonna go with him. And there we have the control scheme for the game. It's 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 a lot simpler than it looks. Don't be intimidated by it, all the the uh, controls and different button combinations be seeing you around it goes <laughs> big old dude don't know his name yet this is only the second time we've actually played the game I was messing around with it before last night so kind of going in blind here 
Welcome to El Tambra. And a whole bunch of riff raff that obviously looks like they want to get their asses kicked. I will gladly oblige you. Yeah. Street Brawl. Explore the stages and earn points. Collect points. Various missions will become available. Main missions and free missions. Free missions can be replayed as many times as you like. Main missions will advance the story. Kind of self-explanatory. Defeating an enemy will unlock that enemy's character model in the gallery mode viewer. So basically you go around, beat everybody's ass, and that lets you unlock missions. And then you go through the missions, earn points and stuff like that, and then... Oh! Okay, that was nice. So basically that'll be how you progress through the game. That is one stiff power bomb right there. Standing in a mission circle will initiate a mission. Don't want to start one yet. Got a whole bunch of punks here that need to get there. Butts whipped. We're gonna clear them out first. Walk into the mission circle. No, no, we're not gonna do all that yet. We gotta play Street Sweeper first. Okay, you can link the grapple in to a combo. Look at this dude just sitting up here. What's wrong with you? Just lamping in the cut. We don't play that. Don't you know I'm from the Bronx? We don't play that shit. Ooh, juggle. I like that one. Look at this dude. Is he running away? He's running away. I'm not even gonna bother. Ah! Stun gun. Oh! What the heck was that? I think that was a radial attack. Ah, he got me again. Son of a bitch. And I'm gonna have to go into the practice mode and see how the moves are. First stage replenishes health. No kidding. Look at them running again. What are they running for? Oh, wait. Apparently there's something chasing after us that might run me over. Ah! Okay, that's what was chasing after me. Son of a bitch. Get off that. Ow. Okay. Lesson learned. Don't punch the fuel canisters. Because they'll explode and set you on fire. And when you think about it, that should be common sense, but, you know. Bear with me here, like I said, this is my first time. <laughs> this dude's hiding behind a freaking car. Aye! Okay, that was not very intelligent there. Oh, it burns, it burns! Ooh! That was messy. Okay, we're next, we're next. I see more guys on the map down low, they're coming. Here they go. What is that? That just gave me something, I don't know what, yet. I'll figure it out. Have a taste of my Fist! Serving knuckle sandwiches! An OA system has been discovered. Ah. To replenish health. Alright. And you can't attack while you're inside of that thing. And they can't attack you while you're inside of that thing. Guess that. That's pretty fair when you think about it. If I can't hit them, they shouldn't be able to hit me. Alright, we're back to full power here. 
20 hit combo. Super power. Okay, I got some kind of glow around me. Guess that increases my uh, attack power or something. I don't know. W look at these fools running. They're running away like a bunch of little bitches. Come on, I need to find somebody else to beat up here. Maybe I'll go for one of those missions now. This is the one that opened up a free mission. Let's see what happens here. The Kill Seekers. Defeat 50 enemies in 5 minutes. Yeah, I think we can do that. Let's give that one a shot. Kill Seeker. Twisted beings mutated by a plethora of chemical weapons deployed during the last great war and vile cocktail of pollutants released into the atmosphere, blah, 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 blah. You can read all that. Basically, they're the low-level, standard-issue, easy-to-beat-the-snot-out-of-enemy. No fighting game is complete without them. And I have to smack 50 of them in 5 minutes. Is it me or is this dude rapping on this track sounding a lot like Rick Ross? I know it's not Rick Ross, but he sounds like him. I'm just saying. You and your little torches trying to set me on fire. Oh, okay, dropkick. Know how to do that one now. Oh, runaway vehicle. Run. Ooh. Damn, he just missed me right there. Or should I say, I just missed it. Let's see if anybody runs away from me this time. Ooh. Killer elbow. It was more of those fire guys. Throwing whatever it is they are. Molotovs. Where are they at? Over here. Okay. Mazeltov. Ow. What the heck? Okay, I guess he's taken care of. Now he's taken care of. Get some help. Go in and get in their asses. Oh, okay, maybe not that time. Trying to see if there's a ground grapple. Stop throwing that stuff at me. Little oh, bitches. Ooh, air combo. Gotta remember that. Look, it's the fire department. Pyro kill seeker. Mutants can be killed by burning bodies or destroying. Yeah. You saw it. Just rewind the video and hit pause and read what it said. Ah, it burns, it burns. Stop. Make the bad man stop. Have a headbutt and a power bomb. Ew! I gotta remember to stay away from those things. And to stay away from these things. No, oh, you won't stun me again. Ooh, there we go. Some power moves. Killer Chainsaw action. Give me some energy back. There we go. One more. Yikes. What the? Executioner. Yeah. Wouldn't be a mission without a 
good old fashioned boss battle, now would it? Let's try to use this thing on it. Okay, maybe not. That ain't work. Ah, that ain't work either. Okay, I think I'm gonna need some more firepower. Let's see how this does. Yeah, that did it. Woo! That's what I'm talking about right there. Silver medal. Not bad for the first time. Points earned in each mission will be added to the point total shown in the results screen. Successfully completing a mission will increase the amount of bonus points you earn. Sounds simple enough. Yeah, I did pretty damn good there. Minute 30 left. Cleared it out. And now we're back on the streets. And they're coming after me again. Come on now, let a brother breathe already. So, if I wanted to, I could go back into that mission again and do it over. Try to get a higher score. Gold medal. I'm assuming that will probably give me more uh, perks or treats or whatever it is, but... I want to see what else is out here first. Oh, look at that. I need 10,000 more points to unlock a new mission. So I guess we'll just go for that. Ooh, Split the difference. Is this fool running it here? Oh, you ain't getting away this time. Oh, no. Ow. You guys really get on my nerve. Yeah, now I got on the thing. Oh. Okay. Main mission. Alright. Now we're getting somewhere. Burn, you son of a bitch. Burn. Alright, let's... Where was that again? Check the map. Runaway vehicle. Let's get out of the way here before I get run over. Oh. Another one of these guys running away with something. Let's see what you got there, buddy. Hit him already. What are you doing? Thank you. Oh, ouch. Okay, I got a missile launcher, apparently. Oh, get up, big mama. Okay, where's the missile launcher? Ah, there it is. And what the heck did I just do? What is this, stealth mode? Yeah, I think it is, because they were about to run right past me. They don't even see where I am. Okay. That's cool. Stealth mode. Gotcha. There's got to be a manual somewhere that I can see where all the uh, power-ups and perks and all the rest of this jazz is. But, uh, I think I'm going to start the main mission on the next installment of this here uh, walkthrough. Because I've already gone through one and I don't want this to run too fast. Run too long. Oh. Unlock some art. Concept art. Cool. Yeah, so, uh. We'll start the main mission in the next installment of this playthrough. So. That'll be that for this one. <laughs>